Hey everybody, it's Vitaly here at Red Barn Productions, and uh, I had a viewer on one of my cakewalk videos. Uh, I'm going to assume it's one about mapping the MIDI and uh, the X Touch. Uh, uh, he wanted to know if, when you used all these knobs right here, if they, if they would work to control uh, the EQ and pan and uh, plugins and stuff. The short answer is yes. I don't even have to have the X Touch because I have an X32 console here that will control a DAW. But I got this before I got the X32, and I've had the X32 about three years now. But I keep the X Touch because it comes in handy, like controlling the X32 rack. Uh, it works in most of my uh, DAWs. Uh, I use it in uh, Xplit Broadcaster. I've used I use it in. Adobe Premiere Pro. It just it just comes in real handy for anything that needs MIDI control, and uh, and I still don't use it for every single thing that, that it's capable of doing. Uh, you know, uh, not even in Cubase. <laughs> but uh, let's pull up the DAW here. Open a project. Uh, hopefully, you can see everything you need to see. Let's select this track here. It's, let's unmute it. If you look over here in the EQ section, well, first off, if you look right up here at this row of buttons where it says uh, track, pan, surround, EQ, send, plug in, inst uh, instrument. I'm going to hit uh, EQ right quick. And I'm blind and don't have my glasses on. Let's do EQ. And yes, you can see it's turning the knob there. See it? See it right, right here. pan go over and hit the uh, the pan button and then you come over to this knob right here you can't really see because my hands in the way but right here and then we're, we're on track this track right here and you can see that it controls the pan and then if I, I work the fader it, it controls the, the fader and all that uh, there is a way to map the plugins, and some of them may already be mapped. I just haven't figured out how to do it. Let me hit plug in. And that may be up here at the compressor that I'm seeing. Still on EQ. I'll have to figure that out and then get back to you on it. But it, for the most part, yes, it, it is working. And I, I may have to actually open the plugin up in the window. Uh, let me see what plugins do I have? Any plugins on? I'm using the stock plugins on this just to prove that they sound good. Uh, I don't forgot where I was at on this mix. Anyway, this is my tally here at Red Barn Productions, and I hope that helps. Uh, Y'all have a good evening, and I'm out of here.